reasonable doubt that rinsing out your hips each morning will be
That's close enough. What the hell are you doing wandering around here? Curiosity can get a Wastelander killed. I'm going to let you through, but you'll have to talk to Mr. Walker first. Follow me. Oh, and stay off the memorial steps. They have orders to shoot anyone that gets too close. The dirt path is safe. Keep moving. Mr. Walker is waiting. Well, who do we have here? I'm Leroy Walker, and you're probably wondering about what we're doing here. You're a sharp one. We're from Paradise Falls. We're hunting runaway slaves. Have you seen any? You are really starting to piss me off. Lucky for you, I don't have time to give you an attitude adjustment. Just answer one question and you can go. What do you know about the Temple of the Union? Then I'm just going to have to kill you.
You have a picture. And such a large one, too. I'll have no problems restoring the memorial with this. Thank you. What do you need? Don't let me... You are truly a good person. So many others refuse to help us. Everything is done? I can hardly believe it. We are finally gonna realize the dream. We'll start out within the hour. We'll meet you at the site. Better have someone check that out. Hey there. Uh, right. Thanks for the picture. It's given me a lot to do. Watch your step. I hope you succeed, stranger. I can't. Wait to set up a school. Cleared out, I guess. Hello.
Hello. Hello. Yes. What appears to have been a wound. Tamper with so what'll it be today? We've got some noodles and the Brahmin steak is pretty good too. Here, take a look. Enjoy. The thunder of his voice. You came in here on your own. You done? Good. says not to talk to you. Hey, don't mind this. Good hunting. Hell of a day, isn't it? So much to do, so little time to do it. All clear here.
How the hell is that my problem? They're complaining we've confiscated all the medical supplies. Well, I need something to pay the caravan drivers with. I ran out of cigarettes and booze last week. So what do I tell them? You mean besides, go soak your heads in the basin? Sir? Fine. Grab some meds from the supply, but tell them that's it. Put up railings or something. Yes, sir. Tamper with that, and, and we're going to have a And hang a sign problem. outside my... Gotta hand it to you, kid. That was a brave thing you did, risking your life to start the purifier. But, do you know? You've made my life a living hell. I'm guessing not. The hero of the wasteland probably has more important things to worry about, don't you? Oh, I'm sorry. Was I being rude just now? Maybe I should congratulate you on getting through the door. After all, you did have to trip over that never-ending line of people waiting to get in here. I'm Scribe Bigsley. And I'm more than a little busy. Right. Yeah, I heard about your dad. Sorry, kid. I don't mean to sound unsympathetic. <laughs> really. But if you understood the pressure, you know the wasteland. I imagine trying to get fresh water to every known settlement without getting it stolen by raiders or our mutants. Now, imagine doing that without any trained soldiers or military resources because they've all been exhausted fighting a little war with the Enclave. Yeah, that's my job. Not to mention the mountain of crap I get from all the lab coats running around underfoot. Really? Well, yeah, there's plenty of things I need help with. But most of it's pushing papers and knocking sense into giant eggheads. Eh, a task for any acolyte, really. I'm sure I could put your experience and talents to far better use. Well, I've got Rivet City water caravans needing help with some uh, unusually organized bandits. Need someone to go investigate what that's all about. And then there's Megaton. They want more Aqua Pura. I just sent a shipment to them. Need someone to go visit Megaton and see what their problem is. Not that it's really any of your business, but we have an arrangement. He buys water, I send him some. I use the caps and tech he pays me to fund the other water deliveries. I send my men with the water to the museum authority on the mall. Griffin sends the payment back with my men. So far, so good. Lions wouldn't approve, but I don't really care anymore. I need the resources, and there's certainly plenty of water to go around. Don't get me started about Rivet City. They feel entitled to everything. Always whining about how they're our scientists and all that crap. Like they did us a favor. Thought the security deal we'd worked out with them would be you know, a win-win. And my hope was they'd completely take over the water caravan escorts by now. But I got Officer Le Pelletier bitching about an organized bandit syndicate. Guess they don't have the chops after all. I need you to go visit Officer Le Pelletier and lend a hand. Great. Hopefully you can get them straightened out. We really can't do this without them. Maybe you should write this down. Go talk to Officer Le Pelletier at Rivet City and help her figure out what's happening to her caravans. I don't know what to think. I got lions breathing down my neck about it, though. Apparently, Megaton's sending him nasty letters demanding a shipment. I just sent them a week's supply. A month's if they ration. Look, if you can straighten out Megaton so I get lions off my back, I'll make it worth your while. Really? Oh, that's great. Uh, I'm sorry I can't offer you any support in this. All our resources are uh, tied up at the moment. Good luck.
Oh, and uh, of course I'll have a little something for your efforts, if you're successful. Yeah, stay safe out there. I need someone to... Many of us keep asking that same question. The Brotherhood isn't a postal service. We have important things to do, and we need caps and technology to do it. Lyons is on some kind of mission. Has he forgotten about the Enclave? That's our priority. But yeah, things are being done to offset the cost of Lyons' little pet purity project. If I did, I wouldn't tell you. I'm just doing what I'm told to do by Lyons. Even if I don't like doing it. Look, it's not that I don't trust you. I know you're trustworthy, but you see, that's just it. I don't think you're capable of discretion. Nothing immoral is going on, but... <clears throat> I'm already in a lot of hot water with the Brotherhood. I need to be careful with what I say and to whom. Well, by all means, I'd love to answer some questions. I've got nothing better to do. She apparently decided to pursue more interesting projects up north in the Commonwealth. The real reason? She couldn't handle us scribes improving upon her work. She's the kind of woman who needs to be in charge of everything. Good luck to her out there in the wasteland. <laughs> it's a long walk to the Commonwealth. Can't say she'll be missed. Um, because it's not irradiated? Really? You couldn't work that one out for yourself. I don't think anyone really knows the answer to that. Seems to be going rather quickly, though. I'm sure you can imagine the chaos if we just let anyone who wanted to wade into the basin and fill up a jug. Frankly, there just isn't the time or the resources to deal with that crowd control nightmare. You take a bottle, you dunk it underwater, and glug, 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 it fills up. Amazing. But you're right. A machine would help, but all the scribes are busy reverse engineering Enclave gear. A machine that puts water in bottles just isn't on anyone's priority list at the moment. Yeah, well, when you remember what it was you were going to ask, take it up with one of the other scribes, okay? Thanks. Hey, what is it this time? Sure. It's not like I'm going to be able to get much done today anyway. Ask away. I literally can't remember the last time I got sleep. I must have dozed off recently, though, if the, <laughs> the drool on my desk is any indication. <sighs> I follow orders, but I'm not exactly a yes man. I figure a scribe's job is to find the devil in the details. Consequently, I seldom get promoted. I think Elder Lyons finally had his fill of people questioning him. And while Scribe Rothschild and I usually see eye to eye on things, so it's apparently time to set an example for those who ask too many questions. Yeah, that's a long story, actually. I started out in the swords. I got the output of a few laser rifles. Apparently, some initiates couldn't handle the extra power. <laughs> a few got hurt. Then I joined the shields. <laughs> Bowditch wasn't all that pleased with me, proving him and his theories on force field resonance were a bit antiquated. And I found myself among the quills. Jameson refuses to accept any fact that conflicts with her rose-colored, optimistic views. She likes to assign contradictory personalities to field operations. Take, for example, myself here, or Yearling, exiled to that accursed library. You know, I used to think Rothschild and I were on the same page. <laughs> Turns out he's happy to blindly follow the old man's orders like the rest of them. It's 
probably best if I don't answer that question. <sighs> if I'm lucky, I might. Boss napping at his desk again. I'm tired of this. I missed the Citadel. You know, I didn't sign up with the Brotherhood to be an errand. You're telling me that? Yes? Look, I'm busy. Can we do this some other time? You haven't heard? I guess I shouldn't be surprised. She basically folded. After the purifier was started, she decided she'd had enough and headed up north. Said she was looking for the Commonwealth, like she'd ever make it on her own. Tell you what, you run into her, you tell her Daniel sends his regards. What's it look like? I'm doing my work, same as I've always done. These Brotherhood scribes wouldn't know what to do with half the equipment here if their lives depended on it. I'm basically running this place from behind the scenes, no matter what Bigsley tells you. Yeah, sure, whatever. Sorry, can't stop the chat. So much to do, so much to do. So much to do, so much to do. Hey, good to see you. I heard you had a bit of a problem getting the purifier started. Sorry about that. We're looking into exactly what happened. Anyway, it's great to see you on your feet again. We wouldn't be here now without you. Oh, well, she, uh, after what happened to you when the purifier started, I think she just kind of had enough. It was really hard on her, you know? First losing your dad, and then the Enclave, and then the Brotherhood taking over here. It was really just too much for her. So I guess she packed up a few things and headed off north, towards the Commonwealth. Rumor has it there's a scientific community up there. I sure hope she finds what she's looking for. Me? Well, I figured after all the work we already put into this place, we could help the Brotherhood keep things running smoothly. It's worked out pretty well so far, I think. They're not necessarily the friendliest bunch, but I've been doing what I can to get along with them. Catch you around.
You have been good to your word. You are welcome at the Temple of the Union any time. Take these schematics as a token of our gratitude. It's a small thing, but I'll give you ten caps for it. If they are lost, it will be a great tragedy. Please take great care of them. I suppose these have some small value to the faithful. I'll give you 15 caps for it. If they are lost, it will be a great tragedy. Please take great care of them. His real voice? How is that possible? I must have it. I'll give you 50 caps for it. If they are lost, it will be a great tragedy. Please take great care of them. His actual rifle? Such a priceless artifact. You must let me have it. I'll give you 150 caps for it. If they are lost, it will be a great tragedy. Please take great care of them. Later. Thanks to you. Hello. Thanks to you, we're rebuilding the You've memorial. come to see us. I am most come honored see. to see you again, ma'am. You want something? Good hunting! <laughs> 